there could be myriad of reasons for this. He is expectations. That is both realistic or unrealistic expectations. Realistic expectations, we set some some target. We set like to basically focus on realistic expectations set big ideas big What's happening here? Why are you the big fish. Then John, John replied, he said, I have to do because I just have a tiny little bit frying pan. <laughs> like that, the moral of the story here is like we are given opportunities like the big fish, but because of our self imposed ideas or perspectives, we create our own bottlenecks and abandon or give away the big opportunities that come to us. So how can we gather all our energy with help of friends, family, friends at work? How can we energize our and move forward Just imagine, and you have reached it. Just imagine what kind of energetic, very enthusiastic, because you are trying to reach your goals. And other side, just imagine what kind of a person you you set some goals but for whatever reason you are not reaching your goals you will be most pessimistic and even the small goal looks too big to achieve let me tell you my personal story here recently like say in 2010 october me sanjay and Murli decided like let's get some physical activity we are putting on some extra weight <laughs> let's let's together as a group do so that we can motivate each other so we decided that we will do running on the weekends getting up at 6 on the weekends imagine that so anyway we thought we'll go ahead and do meet once once a week that is on Saturday or Sunday for a couple of hours let's say two three hours at the Flatwoods Park in New Tampa so we started running we started running three miles four miles five miles six miles and seven eight 
we did it slowly but steadily and we could go we could effortlessly do 8 miles one sanjay said how about i think i think sunita also said there are a couple of marathons half marathons around tampa area then we thought okay now we are able to do 8 13 doesn't look big 13 to put into perspective it is from here approximately from here to brandon mall just imagine running from here <laughs> to brandon mall because we could do 4 5 6 7 8 we thought we could do 13 we put and sanjay motivated me to let's do it where nothing got to lose so i ran 38 we registered for it and finally successfully we did it we completed 13.1 miles in 3 hours so that's a personal story i would like to start off sharing with you instead of sharing somebody else's story it's not to boost myself but in a, in a span of five, six months, we could achieve, we set a goal, right? We motivated each other and got 13.5, 13.5. So here, let me summarize what I said so far. Realistic expectations. Both we, we come across realistic and unrealistic goals. Because we don't go in a disciplined manner, we may get pushed back. We may get pushed back and we don't reach our goals. That causes stress. And I gave a little story about how we are given big opportunities, but with our own self imposed bottlenecks, we give away. Right? So now, to achieve long term or short term small goal first one goal try to work plan on it build a framework around it let your friends and family know so that to what you have committed have a disciplined approach Commit to your business. Commit to your business. He would go to work with so much passion and enthusiasm that he would easily overcome all his personal shortcomings so that he could, he could completely dedicate to what he has embarked on. The second one, whenever you start certain things, you will definitely hit the wall. You may fall down. You will have failures. Things will not be successful right away. Right? When we started off, we started having knee, knee pain. We thought we'll put on knee pads. So that, so that improved health. So like that, whenever and you can eat an elephant one bite at a time. <laughs>